Hey guys, welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. This week we're gonna talk about keep your city smiling. So this was a company idea called Snap Bar. They used to be an event services uh, company. And since COVID, they obviously haven't been doing any event services. So they decided to create a new thing called Keep Your City Smiling, where they work with a lot of the local businesses that they were typically working with, but now they're providing those businesses a way to sell their products. Uh, I picked the Austin box. There's one of six. I picked this one because uh, honestly, I like orange. Orange is my favorite color. So that's why I picked this box. Um, so let's go ahead and dig in, see what's inside. Beautifully packaged. It's got a lot going on in there. So let's see, meet the people you're helping smile. I'll go ahead and show you these in a little bit, but let's go ahead and get uh, a lot of, I mean, they, they packaged it well. Let's go ahead and get this out of the way. So I see a few items. Let's go ahead and pick right off the top. I've got a Waterloo tea and lemongrass candle. So it looks like the company name is Waterloo. Um, again, this is all local Austin things. So this is, uh, I mean, it's an enjoyable candle. Burn with in sight, keep away from flammable. Okay, so I mean, your typical um, safety hazards, but um, I mean, it smells great, tea and lemongrass. I mean, it's, it's locally made and you can't go wrong with locally made. Uh, handcrafted soy wax candle so it's a soy wax candle poured in cedar parks texas so this is from cedar parks this uh, particular company uh let's see so what is what is this take a blue bonnet scratch me soap i'm always fascinated with handmade soap i just love how they can just make so many different designs with soap and just how everything can just be really cool like different colors different designs different I mean, they even put like flakes on this one. So this is Lupinus Texensis, a hardy lupine having spikes of intense blue and white flowers, the state flower of Texas. So um, Texas would have a state flower named after them. So, you know, it's Texas. Uh, scratch made soap, soothing oats, relaxing lavender, purifying clay, wild blue bonnets. Um, take a wash on the wild side. So this is really cool, like I said. I always really like soap. Um, there we go. I always really like handmade soaps. I just think that the amount of time and effort people go into hand making them is, is just awesome. And it, I mean, it smells good too. Uh, let's see, next we've got a coaster. So this looks like it's a wood coaster. Uh, North Bank Designs Austin, Texas is the brand, uh, the company. And uh, looking at it, it's a little map of Austin. Looks like the state capital is in the center. So it's got a uh, relative around that area. Really cool. It's solid. It's got material in the back to help it non-slip uh, cork board. So I think that's really cool. It's handmade. That's awesome. That, ooh, this is candy. I think it's chocolate. I like chocolate. Uh, Madu chocolate. Orange clove, 65% cocoa. Madu, I'm guessing that's the name brand of the company. Let's see, from bean to bar. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what it looks like. Oh, it's got orange in it. That's really cool. It's got orange in the chocolate. Look at that. That is awesome. And they even went as far as to give the front a design texture. So they really, they really tried to make their candy bar stand out. If you're gonna make local candy, uh, make it stand out. They, I think they did a really good job with that one. I'm really excited. I mean, I say I'm really excited to you. Let's just go ahead and try it. That didn't go as well as planned, but it's really good. The, the orange was a little hard to chew through but it has really good flavors. Very, very strong orange flavor. If you like orange, really good. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna bother with that one. All right, we got coffee. Greater Goods Coffee Co. Um, this one is cocoa nibs, peanut butter, and smooth are the characteristics. It is a darker roast from Brazil. Brazilian beans, I'm assuming, not obviously from Brazil. It doesn't actually say 
where it's from. This coffee supports Autism Society of Texas. Good for you guys. Autism Society of Texas, they're a supporter. I guess they maybe donate Greater Goods Coffee. I'm not a coffee person, but I mean, packaging wise, it's solid. It's full, so you're definitely gonna get your money's worth. I don't know what each of these individual items were to cost if you were to buy them separately. As a whole, I got this box for $59. Um, unfortunately, they're not doing separate sales anymore. They're only doing 25 boxes per order or more, so they're more catering towards companies. I got this back when they were doing single boxes, so I just happened to get a single box. Um, $59. Do I think all of this stuff is probably worth $59? Probably not, but at the same time, you're getting local stuff. You're not getting items from big name companies. You're getting things that are gonna support local businesses and they're handcrafted and handmade. I mean, you're paying for somebody's kid to go to school. So I think overall, this is really awesome. Again, I don't know if it's worth the $59 as far as value goes, but individual value, I think it's really cool. I'm gonna get into the little people that were helping. So this is a wild soap bar. Maggie Hannes is the person, I guess the owner of the company. And then you've got Madhu, which is the, I'm, I'm probably not saying it right. The chocolate, which is Elliot Kurilep. I probably pronounced his name wrong too. So he started in Austin, Texas. And it looks like um, the soap bar is been going since 1994 so they've been they've been going for a long time i think this was awesome i really enjoyed opening up a little taste of austin i've never been to austin so this was really fun for me i think it's definitely worth trying if you can get your hands on a single box uh i hope y'all enjoyed everything today make sure you come back again next week we're gonna be doing a different box a different thing so i hope to see you then Y'all enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you next week. Bye guys.